But it's in midfield where Vieira and McAlealy, they'll hold all the engine room stuff that will be done between them and the midfield. It will... And Vieira and Roy Keane are usually not at the head of the line, but may have his hands on the trophy. How Roy Keane would love to be there after missing it. A little bit special, a little bit different, and he may be the man to provide it. Here's Patrick Vieira, it's Kilban who's tight to him. About. Make it uncomfortable for them. There is a bit of a breeze. Keane. Now Vieira, under pressure from Kilban. Zidane. Here's Vieira. And the referee just wisely having a word with Clinton Morrison. Yeah, you come in, especially for Clinton, you know, who's really desperate to show people that they should have signed him. He's always said, you know, he's been a little... And, you know, there's so much there from OK, the Vieira history is one thing. But he has a lot of ground to make up. As a... Can they make the most of that bit of luck? Kilban. Vieira kept him... Pe Zidane! Brilliantly clawed away by Shea Given. Vieira gets it back. And we need him for them probably a little bit more. Well, a lot more. So Morris's challenge. Ball played through to Robbie Keane. And Vieira cross. Yeah, Boomsong had stayed behind a few yards and Robbie was in for a moment. Now Duff. Now Wiltor. Vieira. Vieira. That's the sort of occasion for which Ireland raised themselves. Oh, it's a different occasion and a different type of team. You know. And he was the player closest to Keane then when he went down, and he might have made the most of going down, but... Here's Vieira. Them oh. given, time and time again. Given Ireland hope that there may be an Achilles heel there. Reed's corner, and Morrison looks for it, kill bad with the flick back. Vieira. Did early on, was so disappointed the manager, but in fairness to Ireland, they're still closing the gaps and they're not allowing it to go through to the front people, and that's the key. OK, if they keep knocking it around 20, 30 yards, but when they get near that back line, then it becomes dangerous. They've got to work really hard to protect our, the back four. Vieira looks for the killer ball. And the gap was plugged by Cunningham. Yeah. Zidane, though, picks up the threads again for France. Yeah. And he'll have to plug so many more gaps like that. Cunningham. Sky Sports 1, Sunday from 3.30. Oh, that man, uh, <laughs> watching Patrick Vieira, presumably, <laughs> for the first time since he... Uh, watching him, I wonder, yeah. with a little bit of envy. Because his team haven't started as well as he'd have liked. They certainly miss him. I think actually he may have been there at the weekend as well to see the uh, victory over the Faroe Islands in which uh, Vieira played a part. Of course, he was suspended for the first match with uh, Ireland in this group, having been sent off in the fixture against the Faroe. Also got that touch of class too. Enough to put the player off. Vieira, Zidane. Car getting in tight on Dorisu. Here's Vieira. Into the last ten minutes of the half. Another corner for Ireland. Whipped in by Reed. Cleared by Vieira. Roy Keane. Here's Vieira. Well won by Reed. Kilban, though, not able to make the most of it, and Vieira strides there. Vieira. Roy Keane. Duff going down a little too easily there. Ford looking for Henri. Vieira! What a fantastic effort that was. He's furious because it seemed to take an age for anybody to go out and close the shot down. As it's high in the air here, you think somebody will be going out to block it, somebody will be going, but nobody went. It's maybe a yard wide, but it's a worrying moment. You can recall Israel scoring late on with a similar situation where nobody got out. 
Well, at the moment, maybe half-time can't come quickly enough. Well, it's probably a bit harsh. I think Ireland have had a good play, but just the last... Turan. Vieira. Looks to get Henri on the front foot, but Dunn kept his eye. Wiltor. Now Vieira. Five minutes will provide the answer. And Vieira immediately converged on by Kilban and Morrison. An immediate signal of intent. Reed here to try and settle them with a free kick. Dunn found space! Most convincing header. You'll see him pretend to go outside. He goes in. Vieira's left standing still. I think we shouldn't underestimate the value of a 0 0 draw either, Rob, to Ireland. Well, the encouraging thing for Ireland about the closing fixtures is Boomsong. Vieira looking to play through the middle to Henri. Through them. And now they're looking to create their own moments of magic. It's Kilban. But he hasn't won the free kick. Dallas gets it away. Vieira. Back in by Reed. And cleared by Vieira. Just two or three yards too far ahead of Keane. Caught by Robbie Keane. Here's Reed. O'Shea. Zidane had a bit of an injury problem coming into this game anyway from the weekend. It's a calf injury that's efficient. Affect France as they look to hold on to this lead. Push Maluda right up. He's out on his left side. And it... But perhaps the time Robbie now is left for to do something different and take that gamble. Rob, they're really doing their bit tonight. Eight something for us, hopefully. Will Tour. Here's Vieira. Cisse. Well done. Makaleli. Closed down by Duff. Keane finds the ball to Robbie Keane. It's an awful lot harder. Here's O'Shea. Broke up for Sylvain Will Tour. O'Shea. And deflected away by Vieira. And Ireland still have hope. Yep. Have Ireland got it within them to survive in this group? A defeat here will take their fate out of their own hands. Vieira's behind this one and gets it away at the second attempt. Vieira. Kaiser to keep themselves in with a chance in this group. O'Shea's won it back. Now Damien Duff. Run back by Vieira. Back in by Hart, who's... France land. Oh, on Ireland, possibly a knockout blow.